there it is. I think that's it right there. Check these out. All right, everybody, this is the district. And supposedly they have the biggest steak and the most expensive steak in Pensacola. Yeah, tomahawk ribeye. Yeah. Would be good. So we're Serves gonna, too. We're gonna go in here and try it and we're gonna let y'all know if it's worth it. So we're going up to the piano lounge room to get it. Uh, you can get it downstairs in the formal dining room or upstairs. Here they're having piano music time, and that's what we wanted to check out while getting the steak. Upstairs in the lounge. <laughs> I'm really nervous about how big this steak's going to be. I don't think I can eat the whole thing by myself. Check these out. So I think that's it right there. That's what I'm here to do. So we ordered the bachetta. Samantha got hers. <laughs> Got this ton of hot for us, y'all. Holy smokes. Okay, medium rear, of course. Beer cheese, mac and cheese. And of course, our fried Brussels sprouts, y'all. Thank you. All, All right. right. Well, there it is, Samantha. Look at that bone. <laughs> it's awesome. Right. What do you think? Mmm, it smells delicious. <laughs> we got macaroni and brussels sprouts samantha so what do you think it's going to taste like deliciousness i'm going to get kind of an end piece so i get a little crust on it okay So we just finished the $125 steak here at the district. Dry aged tomahawk ribeye to yeah. be exact. Show them the bone. I have the details. Look at that bone. <laughs> so we got to head back to the house and tell y'all our thoughts about it. And uh, if you should order it. Yeah. Look at those shoes. <laughs> Finally in heels. All right, so we're at the house, and Samantha's going to tell you all about our steak expedition. And we got the expert here, Little Jack. He's going to weigh in on Yay. anything he's got to say. So what'd you think, Samantha? Oh, 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 oh no. dude. He's still bubbling at the mouth. So we tried to do this twice. He keeps spitting up. <laughs> all right, everybody. We're here at the house, and Samantha's going to tell you all about this steak and what we thought about it. I thought good yeah. i think um the district steaks are good um the steaks at the district some of them are dry aged beef i think that's the right terms and it was really good it was a tomahawk steak so it had a huge bone the bone is actually still in the fridge yeah oh let me get that, that, that bone <laughs> i had a good bit of meat on it you know it was a ribeye tomahawk ribeye i think is what it's called and 
it has a good bit of fat, so it had a lot of flavor to it. Yeah, check this out. Look at this bone. Isn't that nuts? Yeah, it was huge. You can definitely, I guess it's a rib bone. That's what I'm guessing. I'll, I'll, yeah. It's a good guess. So yeah. it's a ribeye steak though. Um, but yeah, it was good. Um, at the district, you get the steak and then mm. it comes with a la carte sides to share. So we had a nice meal together. I think that the steak yeah. was cooked well. Um, so the, the, good flavor. the steak, the meal really is like a serving for like three. Yeah. Yeah, so like... We ordered it as, you know, for our, both our meals, you know, it was $125 with two sides. Sides are extra, yeah. Are they? Mm -hmm. Sides are extra. So the steak, if you split it into three, you had your sides, like the meal is for multiple people, mm -hmm. not $125 for one person. So oh yeah, it's a shareable, shareable It's not steak. as crazy as if it was just one person. So I just want to throw that in there. You know, of the, of the steak houses we've ate at in Pensacola, which is your favorite so far? Um... The iron was good. You know, Public House had a good steak. Yeah, McGuire's has a great yeah, steak. Yeah, McGuire's. I gotta. We gotta do the pork chops one day because yeah. those are huge. I'm a fillet girl, so I like the fillet ma mignons. Um, so the ribeye and the New York strip and all those steaks are okay. I mean, I'll eat them, but I like a, a good fillet. I think McGuire's yeah. has a great fillet. Uh, the district has a good fillet as well. Yeah, um, yeah. But yeah, it's fun to go to each place because it's a different atmosphere and ambiance. At the district, we sat upstairs and we got to hear the young lady playing piano. So that was nice to do. He's like eating his hand. <laughs> he's an expert on steaks, everybody. Yeah, he's, okay. he's ready for a steak. Yeah, he's like, saying, I'm, I've had enough of this milk stuff. So <laughs> we like the atmosphere of that night out. So if you're looking yep. for more of a like crazy fun atmosphere, go have a steak at McGuire's. Yeah, the, the piano was great. No, it was a fun time. Yeah. Can't say anything bad about it. But that's all we got for this one, everybody. We'll see you on the next adventure video. Woo! Wave bye, little Jack. Wave bye. <laughs> Oh, and one more thing I forgot to add. If you're moving to the Gulf Coast and you're looking for a real estate agent, I'm your guy. If you're looking to buy or sell in the Panhandle, Florida, my email is in the description box below. Let me know and I'll be glad to help you. See you guys on the next one.